and um, yeah, my name is Alexander Sander. I do represent the Free Software Foundation Europe, and we are a charity to empower users to control technology with the use of uh, open source software. And um, we also welcome the aim for more cyber security, also in uh, free and open source software. Um, uh, however, I want to build on what's uh, already uh, have been said here. Um, there are some um, specific issues um, with the um, recital 10 here in the proposed text, and um, it won't fix uh, security in open source um, like on a, on a large level, uh, but it can also harm open source uh, ecosystem, and therefore um, we want to propose a way to ensure more security and at the same time strengthening the open source ecosystem. Therefore, first, um, we need to shift liability from developers to those who deploy the software. And um, second, uh, we need to make sure that those who financially benefit from this deployment should also be the ones who make sure that the software is secure, so that we um, make sure that non-for-profit organizations, for example, are uh, excluded. So free and open source software with it for freedoms to use, study, share, and improve the code makes it very easy for everyone to develop um, and to improve the code, and by thus making it available to everyone. And um, this also means that all others can use and deploy the software without caring too much about the security then. And um, then uh, might, might point to developers um, that get micropayments, small amounts for their work, or even if they are non-profit or even um, do not earn a single euro for their work, um, then might run through these uh, procedures, which um, yeah, uh, is a huge problem to the open source ecosystem. And that's why we want to put the burden of liability to, to those entities um, that um, yeah, deploy um, the open source software. And um, if you put focus on development, uh, that would mean that a lot of free and open source projects have to stop their work as they um, yeah, simply don't have the um, amount and the funding to run through these procedures. Um, so in this regard, the um, CIA should replace the concept of commercial activity with an approach that focuses on deployment and the entity that benefits on the market. We want an exclusion for non-for-profit entities and micro-enterprises and um, at the same time, um, yeah, the liability should be then moved towards those deploying these solutions and are bigger than um, non-for-profit or micro-enterprises. By thus, it is ensured that all free and open source software solutions are used on a significant level, are assessed under the CIA, and the financial burden is moved to those who profit um, on the market with those solutions. So by thus, we ensure that small projects are properly funded uh, or that those um, deploying the software make sure um, that it is secured by their own. And um, by the nature of FOSS, that we can use study, share, and improve it. And um, these changes will be then also available to everyone, uh, which increases the level of security for all. Um, we also want to move it to an article. So that would be also good. So the recital, the recital to an article. And um, yeah, that's from uh, the point from our side. Thanks a lot.